had been a contrasting campaign for Köln and Hanover so far. Peter Stöger's side were enjoying their best start to a Bundesliga season for 19 years and a win would move his side up to fourth. Meanwhile, the visitors were enduring their worst start since the late 1980s. Clear-cut chances were few and far between in the first half as Köln struggled to break through a very organised Hanover side. Marcel Riese's effort on 33 minutes, which was beaten away by Ron Robert Zieler, was their best effort of the first period. Not too long after that, Hanover went ahead in controversial circumstances. Hiroshi Kiyotake's corner found its way to Leon Andriasen, who put the ball in for his first Bundesliga goal since September of last year, although Köln were convinced it shouldn't have stood. After an awful start to the season, Hanover appeared to have a spring in their step and they almost doubled their lead on the stroke of half-time with Artur Sobiec only denied by a smart stop from Timo Horn. So Köln went in at half-time on course for a first home league defeat in 2015 with Peter Stöger trying to discuss the Andreasen goal with referee Bastian Danke. The second half saw a few more chances than the first period, but the ones created by Köln were all repelled by Ron Robert Zieler. Anthony Modest denied by the Cologne-born keeper on 65 minutes. And then, with just under a quarter of an hour to play, substitute Philip Hosnia was denied a goal minutes after coming on by an even better stop from Zieler. It was to be a second successive match-winning turn from the Germany international, who then stopped another Modest header four minutes from time, and Frederick Sorensen couldn't hit the target from close range as Köln's unbeaten run at home came to an end.